Let me try to turn the phone here a little bit so that you can see. Bear with me. What is going on? Okay, so I wanted to unbox some of the items that we got from Thailand and my wonderful husband and son gave me permission to come in to work for a couple hours. But I wanted to show you what we have. So, we have these two boxes, but then that's not it. We have all of these. So it's gonna, it's gonna take us some time. Let me turn on the light. Maybe if I can reach it. Um, so it's gonna take us a little while to get through it all. But I figured you might enjoy a little VIP first sneak peek look here. So we're gonna give this a go. And I'm excited uh, because some of the items that we brought back are um, Thai pillows, which are used a lot in Thai massage. Uh, and typically they are stuffed with cotton and then with a fabric or a material and I I don't know how to pronounce it. It's either kapok or kapok, um, but it is a fiber that um, I believe it's grown in the rice fields. So anyway, these pillows we have been eyeing for years. You can find them on Amazon, but we wanted to bring back a selection of our own. And since it's our first time dealing with customs and freight shipping, cargo freight, uh, we were afraid that that stuffing material was going to create an issue with customs. Um, so we had all of the pillows made for us with 100% cotton. So they're not a traditional Thai pillow, um, but the, just because of the stuffing, but the shape and everything is. So I am so excited to go through and look at these. I've only taken out one so far to get an idea of what it looked like. So let's get started. Um, and I'm gonna get up and walk around, so bear with me. This is a big box of them, so we can see the colors and the different shapes that are in here. And I'm going to leave them wrapped in the plastic just because the fabric is so pretty and I would hate to get it dirty before somebody bought it. So the first pillow is a nice long one. Let's see if you can see. It's kind of skinny. It's a double row. It's all connected. It's all one one piece but they're nice they're squishy but they're firm so these would be great um, if you were to lay down on your back and needed something to rest your legs on you can use these um, this green it's so pretty it's probably my favorite so this is the long one and then we also have a short one and this is the red color a little bit of glare from my light but um, but it's a nice deep like cranberry red. So that is the shorter pillow. To give you a little size reference here, that's the two of them next together. And then, oh, we have, okay, hold on, it's a little hard getting it out of the box. Okay, so these are the ones that I'm really excited about. But this is a big mat, and I actually have one. I cheated a little uh, and opened up one of them yesterday because I was super excited to see it. So, get this box out of the way. Maybe. So this is really big pillow. And I'm going to show you because I have one unwrapped so you can see what it is. But that's that same deep red color. But, this is the one that's unwrapped. Let's flip it around so you can see it here. So it has the big triangle portion attached to it that flops over. But now you can unfold this whole thing and lay down on it. And it has a built-in pillow. So it's Super long. I'd lay on it, but then I can't hold the video to show you how long it is. So, and they're thicker, you know, and they're they're nice and squishy. 
super supportive and then you fold it right back up when you're ready to store it and it takes that much space i know megan aren't they fantastic how you doing girl how's married life okay so i can't really see if i don't turn it around so that is the blue one but those are the big um matte triangular pillows so i'm gonna try to stick this red one back in the box just so i can have it out of the way and then we're gonna see the next box I'm so excited about these. These I met when I was walking around. <laughs> You're funny. Uh, when I was uh, walking around in one of the markets, I met a gentleman. You may remember a video that I shared of super sweet Thai gentleman. Man, this stuff is hard. I'm winded right now. Whew. That uh, was playing his guitar and played us some Bob Marley, and I shared the video of him and his name is Tawi, but he makes these pants that I fell in love with and was gonna buy some from him but he gave us a good enough deal that I bought his whole shop worth that he had on the floor um, but they are like sweat pant material super soft on the inside but they're um, harem pants so harem sweat pants check these out he calls them Aladdin pants I don't know if I can get these in the video. They are longer, low crotch pant, and they have a little pocket on the side. Even a nice stretchy elastic waist. And they are so comfortable. And Megan just showed up, so I'm gonna see if I can get her to try on a pair so you can actually see them on somebody. So we're gonna set these to the side. So that is the light blue color. We also have them in a gray, which are a little bit heavier weight. Um, like a, like your favorite hoodie, kind of. It's a soft, soft, super soft cotton. Um, this one is a heavier weight than that blue one. And then we have a brown color, almost like a camel color those and the camel color is really cute because it has this fabric edge on the pocket on the side it's just a cute little detail on them then we have a solid blue color my lighting is a little bit off so there's a golden hue we have a couple purples which you know Megan if you're into these I got you purple and then we have a gray color. And there's probably, there might be a little bit of variation in color. Um, and I don't remember how many of these I bought, but I, I know it was a lot. So I, I wanna say we might have 60 pair or so. Um, so different colors and assortment. But there's other goodies in this box too. And now the pants was as far as I've gotten. I haven't cheated. <laughs> I do, just a little bit, Megan. So I haven't cheated too far, so bear with me while I try to open up these plastic bags here to show you. I think these are all headbands. Yes, it's that nice stretchy uh, mud me fabric. And these are a nice long tube headband. Great for dreadies. Uh, those of us with dreads that need to keep them covered if we're hiking or outside or, you know, anything actually. Um, but they're a nice, the tube, super stretchy, really comfortable, but you can scrunch them up and make them a regular headband or you can wear them all the way out. You can make hats, kind of like a beanie out of it too and style it that way. Um, they're amazing and they're so comfortable. So she didn't have many when I was shopping with her, so I bought the stock that she did have. So we'll have those. Let's see what else we got. Now mind you, I bought most of this stuff in January. So going through these boxes is like Christmas 
I don't even remember what's in here. Um, but it's a great trip down memory lane for the past few months. What do you like, Beth, the headband? We've got a bunch of different, these are all kind of the same thing. So we have all different, hi, Kara. We have all different colors, but they're all the same thing. Yes, Megan, exactly. The Mud Me is a great fabric that, uh, super lightweight, super stretchy, incredibly comfortable, but stays cool when it's wet. Um, so yeah, stuffing them with ice and leaving them on the back of your neck would be amazing. That's a great idea. Ooh, I remember these are the tank pink. These the tanks? Yes, these are longer weight tanks. Yeah, Beth, they are great. Oh, and before I get too much further, if y'all haven't seen the event, we picked a date, um, May 5th, I think. It's that Sunday. We're gonna do a VIP preview event. So, you love toys? Toy? I love toy? Carrie, are you speaking English right now? <laughs> I love you too. Oh. Um, so May 5th, I believe, is that Sunday from 5 to 7. We're going to do a VIP sneak peek event. Um, so anybody that it, you see anything on these videos that you like, that will be your first opportunity to buy them. Um, and then we'll release everything for the general public. And for all of our other amazing shoppers. Uh, and some of this stuff probably won't be online on our website, just because shipping it will be a little bit harder um, because of the size of it, but then because they're all different patterns and things too. But this is the longer length tank. This is one of the colors. Let me stand up a little bit here. So this is here, it comes down to what, just below the waist a little bit. And it's a nice light, super light rayon fabric. It moves really nice. So those guys would definitely keep you cool or help you stay cool in the summer. I don't remember how many. We looks like we got 21 pieces. And I think they're all different. So there's a blue one. <laughs> okay, so there's the blue and just really pretty mandala work on them. And then there's a cranberry color and a wine color, but you get the idea. Oh, Megan, okay, fine, I'll go through it for you. There's a blue. There is really pretty cranberry color. There is, this is more of a burgundy color. Oh, good, there is more than one of each. Let me scoot up a little bit. It's almost maybe a brown. Um, yeah, brown, but it's got like a reddish brown color. And, oh girl, there's lots. Yeah, oh absolutely, this green one. Holy crap, this one's beautiful. Look at the pattern on that. Yeah, that one's good. And that's all you're gonna get. If you wanna see any more colors, you're just gonna have to come join us on the fifth. Cause there's teals and turquoise and I see a little bit of purple in there too. Okay, so, moving on. What else do we got in this box? All right, I got some more Mud Me here. And Mud Me, uh, Mud Me, in case you all don't know, is beautiful uh, tie-dye that the ties are very protective of. There are no books or classes or formal instruction. Um, on how to do it, but it's amazing and it's a super stretchy, incredibly soft, very comfortable fabric. So this, whatever this is, is in these colors here. So let's unwrap one and see what it is. Ooh. Ooh. These are a wider leg kind of yoga pant. They are stretchy at the waist. They've, there is a, an elastic that runs through there that's that long. I don't know if you can see what I'm pinching that off to. Um, but then at the bottom of the leg, they do get 
a little bit wider. Those are super cute. They do look, and actually they're a good length too. I'm tall, so finding pants that are a decent length for me are pretty hard, but these actually look like they might be pretty decent. So we have six of those. And it looks like each one of them is a different color, different pattern. And I got some Mud Me Patchwork. These are, I'm excited about. Well, I'm excited about all of it. Who am I kidding? And I can't even say I'm excited about these because I honestly don't remember what they are. So let's find out. Oh, look at the colors in that. Wide leg pants. So again, it has the elastic stretchy waistband and it has a thicker band, uh, about an inch of actual elastic that runs through there. Oh my God, those are so cute. So those guys, I just need Megan to come back here and be my model. But these guys, oh, these guys are nice and long. So if I were to wear them kind of high waisted, I don't know if you can see all the way down to my feet down there, but they are, those guys are a good length, which is good. Might have to snag a pair of those for myself. But we have, let's see, it doesn't say how many we have, I'd have to go through that bag, but I know there's not many. And these guys are great because they use the scraps of um, their other mud me designs to make these. Which is why you can't always, you're not guaranteed the colors and things that you're going to get in them. And there's a lot in here. I still have these pants, the harem sweatpants. But I want to get them out of the way so I can see what else is in the bottom of the box. Because there's more mud me down here. Hi, Kim. Okay. These are regular headbands with the elastic in the back that stretch out. And these are a rayon, so they're not, like the fabric itself isn't stretchy, but the back elastic part is quite a bit. So you got a nice comfy fit. But that is one of the orange ones. So you slide that out and you can either keep it scrunched up for a thinner headband, or when it's on the head, stretch it all the way out. And then it looks almost like a, more of a bandana type. So we have a few of those, and those are, I don't know if you can really see, the colors, I need to block that light up there, but those are the colors of the headbands there. Next bag. Oh, these are same style headband, um, but these are the traditional Mudney fabric. So, I'll show you, they've got the stretch in the back, same way, same style, but this material is a lot stretchier. It's the what all the clothing and stuff is made out of. It's got spandex in it. Um, so those are those headbands. Again, wear them scrunched up or stretch it all the way out and it's more of a bandana. And these are the colors that we have for those. I'm making such a mess back here. Ah, what else do we got in here? So this is a bag. These are the colors of whatever this is. And this feels like it might be more uh, more pants like the other ones. Hi, Beth. Maybe, but it feels a little bit thicker. Let's see. Oh, no. These are, which one is this? Ooh, this is one of the dresses. Look how pretty these are. Okay, so again, I can't stress how comfortable the Mud Me stuff is. Has a little bit of a ruffle detail around the neck and down the front. And then it has a seam kind of at the waist. It's almost like a high, um, not a princess seam, but a little bit higher cut um, seaming there. And it comes all the way down and it's probably you know for me because I have longer legs it's uh, above the feet I don't know if you can see there um, but colors are all different 
Oh, that one's super pretty. And the hemline, let me see here. The hemline is even. So um, I'll tell you whether the hemline is a, like a even or um, fairy hem is when it's kind of a, a jagged hemline. So these guys are straight and the colors are beautiful. But I just love a little bit of that extra detailing around the neckline. Hey, Brett. Empire. Yes, thank you, Kim. What else do we got here? Oh, scrunchies, because I don't know if y'all remember the 80s, but apparently these are coming back. Um, but same mud me fabric that, you know, just put around a, a ponytail, or if you have a cute little bone up top, you put around the top. I bought all she had. She didn't have too many, so there's just a little, little bag of the colors there. Here's a bag. We've got like a green one, really pretty burgundy one, and a really pretty like pink and purple. And let's see, they've got ID numbers on the bag. So this is something different. I love how organized they keep things when they're shipping, at least this stuff. So this is the really pretty pinky purple one. Oh, this is uh, a long jacket, a long sleeve. I don't know if you'd still call it a cardigan, because it's, but it's a a jacket. Let's see, I got my sweater on, but there you go. So it's open, no buttons, long sleeve, and but it's really long, down below, below my knees. But if that doesn't give you an idea of how stretchy it is, I mean, I have my my sweater on underneath and it goes on super easy. Those are so pretty. Yeah, those are great. Over duster. Look how smart you people are. Um, yes, duster, exactly. Super cute with um, jeans and a plain colored tank top. Um, or even maybe over a solid color dress as an accent. So pretty. Okay, number 39, whatever this one is, this one we've got, this is probably one of my favorite color combos that they do with the Mud Me. It's got a deep, a deep blue in there and a lighter turquoise blue and a um, nice bright like a Kelly green. But then we also have a pink, a yellow, and a, like a almost like a rusty orange color, but pale. But let's see what these are. Okay, this is another dress. And it's a little bit more simple than the other one. It has more of a cowl neck detail. So these are the shoulders here. Me too, Brett. Blues and greens are my favorites. Earth and water. So if these this was on your shoulder, it just has a little bit of a drape here for a nicer neckline. Um, and then higher waisted too, to be a little bit more flattering. And these have an even hem as well. And it's a little bit longer. It's not quite down to my ankles. It's just a little bit below my, uh, my knees. Whatever those things are called. But yeah, oh, so pretty. We're gonna have too much fun with this stuff. I don't know about you guys. Hopefully you'll come and join us on the fifth. Try not to mix up my bags so I know the ID numbers. All right, we got two more Mud Me packages in here to see what's here. Okay, I've got six of whatever these are. So you can see, I'll show you the colors here first and then I'll take one out. Take out a pink one. Unban this guy. Okay, this is maybe more of what I would think of a, a cardigan or even a shorter length duster. So, this one, I'll slip this one on too. So it has a little bit of the extra fabric here, just for a little bit of kind of a decorative element and extra coverage. But that's the length that is just below the butt. 
there in the back. But that one is the pink one. Oh, so pretty. I don't know about you guys, but I'm so excited doing this. Yeah, those are beautiful. So we've got that turquoise blue, like that last dress that I pulled out. This is the pink. We've got a neutral orangey green color. We've got a purple, Megan, if you're interested. So nice. I had told my husband once that when I was over on any of my trips in Thailand, if I find a family that will welcome me in and teach me the art of mud me, uh, dying, I may not come home because I really, really, really want to learn. It's amazingly beautiful. All right, this is our last bag out of this box. It's heavy, whatever it is. There's a lot of them. There are, ooh, this one apparently is a long dress. They wrote a description and there is 10 of them. And these are the colors that are in here. What's in top? Ooh, this purple is really pretty. It's like a deep, a deep color here. Oh, Kara, I don't know if you're still on here, but these remind me of. Hi, Joe. How are you feeling? Kara, I don't know if um, you're still on here, but they kind of remind me of the twist front dresses that you do tie dye in. So it's got more of a narrow shoulder, but still for us ladies, wide enough to cover the bra strap. Uh, but it's got that really pretty, not good, Joe. I'm happy to hear that. We miss you. It has that really pretty twisted knot work there in the back. And then a little bit of a twist there, but not as much in the front. And these guys are quite a bit longer. These are probably ankle length. But that color is gorgeous. Look at that. Oh, so pretty. Cara, does that, I mean, that's kind of the same detail, right? You do those, that twist front dress that you do so well with. It's really pretty. Hey, Melissa, I got started a little early. Melissa is gonna come help me do uh, another bit of an unboxing on Monday. Aren't they gorgeous, Joe? The colors in these are stunning. Melissa, you want everything, so you're just gonna have to wait your turn like everybody else. All right, well, that's it for that one box. Beth, are you gonna come try to join us? I'd love to have you. All right, so this is the mess that I made in the back room here, Got a little pile there. There's still some of those pants in that box. Y'all want me to have Megan try on a pair so you can see them? We got this pile, this pile, and a nice little pile over there. <laughs> Cara, I dare you. Come hang. What do you think? Should I go get Megan and ask her to try on a pair of the pants? <laughs> well, Joe, I'm dealing with a lack of space, and since they're not in the system yet, I don't want to start unboxing everything and not remember what some things are. But... Beth, that would be great. All right, let's go find Megan and see. Give you guys a little tour of the shop here. Walk on up here. <laughs> uh, so, you know, this is Megan. <laughs> Hi. And this is Valerie. Hello. And Megan, we unboxed these and showed everybody. And I really want you to try them on so folks can see what they look like. <laughs> so we're going to walk around the shop a little bit. This is the last vest that I have from Kimmy in Australia. And here, a little feature of our hard-ons here, <laughs> our men's underwear line. Let's check in on Sadie and... Oh my god, guys, Sadie's in her hammock. Look at that little tub muffin. Hi, girl. All right. So we are just gonna wait here for a second for Megan to come out of the dressing room so y'all can see the pants. <laughs> hey, ninja pants. 
<laughs> These are the most comfy pants ever. They're super soft. Warm. And those are the ones that are like kind of. They're a lighter weight. Yeah. The but they're kind of fleece lined, so they're they're super comfy and they'll keep you a little warm too. Yep. And then and the pocket. The and the pocket's just on the one side, yeah. right? Yes. Yep. And you can hike them up. Yeah, and then you have like knickers on. Mm -hmm. You can wear them down. But just I kind of thinking... like wearing them up a little bit, like a high waisted. I do too. It other than just the coverage, they just seem to lay a little bit mm -hmm. better when you wear them a little higher. Yeah, so it's kind of like a high waisted option. Yeah. Super cute. Yeah, those guys are awesome and great for yoga in colder weather because you still have all of the. There you go. Look at you with your tree pose. <laughs> Oh, you've got all of the mobility and movement. Oh yeah, I can get my leg like, up here. <laughs> Come on, dancer. Hey, Andrew, how are you? Hi, Hi, Andy. Andy cut off all of his hair for Grateful Heads this morning. Mm -hmm. That's awesome, Andy. Yep, yep. All right, cool. Well, we are gonna peace out. So those are the pants, and those are the first two boxes of yep. pillows. <laughs> Everybody say bye-bye, bye and we will do another video tomorrow and Monday. So, for those of you that joined us, thank you so much for watching. And uh, we'll do one more tomorrow, and then we'll do another one Monday. We got 16 boxes to work through. We'll see you guys soon.